confrontations across both sides of the Bay have erupted over political conflict and social justice. KPX 5's Joe Vasquez asked protesters on both sides whether incidents at recent demonstrations have helped or hurt their cause. You need to go through your smashing and looting down the street. From the Golden Gate Bridge to the streets of Oakland, demonstrations on both sides of the divide are raising concerns here in the Bay Area. Today, about 250 pro-Trump protesters walked onto the Golden Gate Bridge. They were met by a large contingent of law enforcement and about 50 counter-protesters. These Trump supporters have blood on their hands. Like, they're supporting a regime that rationalizes violence. The rally organizers called their action Rescue America. They denounced the actions that have led to vandalism and even violence. Last night in Portland, a man died from gunshot wounds after a clash between the two sides. According to the Associated Press, the shooting victim was wearing a hat with the insignia of Patriot Prayer, a right-wing pro-Trump group. If there is any legitimate concerns that they have, it's all getting lost in the violence. If they have legitimate concerns, they need to find a different way to express them, because all they're doing right now is repelling people from their cause. Protests ought to occur in the daylight hours when you can read the signs that I'm carrying. Nighttime protests only designed to conceal who's doing the protesting and what they intend to do. Former San Francisco Mayor Willie Brown says President Trump is egging on the violence. He says the Black Lives Matter demonstrations in Oakland in recent days are legitimate, but as for the destruction of property, he says that could end up helping the Republicans in the election. Biden and Harris really ought to decry and indicate how awful it is to engage in the kind of conduct that's being translated into violence attributable to them. Here in Oakland, there are a variety of viewpoints as to whether these demonstrations, when they get destructive, are helping or hurting the cause. People don't do nothing when we're not rioting. If we gotta burn the system down, we're gonna burn it down. What if burning it down gets Trump reelected? It's not. It's not. Because you can be peaceful and sit around and wait and go to the polls and whatnot, but if you see things in your neighborhood that aren't changing, then people get, kind of get fed about to a certain point. You out here destroying property, trying to get your point over. You can't get a point across like that. As an uh, African-American woman, I don't want you out there falsely representing me if you're out there breaking the law and committing crime. Don't represent me, because I don't stand for that. Joe Vasquez, KPIX 5.